Each deed of the seed of Adam is for him except for one. Except for one. O Lord of this blessed month, we praise you for Ramadan. Ramadan. Each deed of the seed of Adam is for him except for one. O Lord of this blessed month, we praise you for Ramadan. And for the book you revealed therein to guide us to the light. Inna alhamdulillah, nahmaduhu wa nasta'inuhu wa nasta'gfiruhu. Wa na'udhu billahi min shururi anfusina wa min sayyati a'malina. Man yahdihi allahu falamudilla lah, wa man yudlil falahadiya lah. وأشهد أن لا إله إلا الله وحده لا شريك له وأشهد أن سيدنا ونبينا محمدا عبد الله ورسوله اللهم صل على محمد وعلى آل محمد كما صليت على إبراهيم وعلى آل إبراهيم إنك حميد مجيد اللهم بارك على محمد وعلى آل محمد كما باركت على إبراهيم وعلى آل إبراهيم إنك حميد مجيد Brothers and sisters in Islam, two-thirds of Ramadan are gone. Are you still trying to make it? Brothers and sisters in Islam, the coming nights are the most precious nights in this month. Amongst these nights, there is a night that if you observe, worship, in it sincerely and according to the sunnah of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam you will be written a worshipper for a, a thousand months 83 years and some month brothers and sisters in Islam Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says قُلْ يَا عِبَادِيَ الَّذِينَ أَسْرَفُوا عَلَىٰ أَنفُسِهِمْ لَا تَقْنَطُوا مِنْ رَحْمَةِ اللَّهِ إن الله يغفر الذنوب جميعا إنه هو الغفور الرحيم أو محمد صلى الله عليه وسلم Till my servants who transgressed They transgressed but yet سبحانه وتعالى The most merciful is still calling them his servants Don't despair from the mercy of Allah إِنَّ اللَّهَ يَغْفِرُ الذُّنُوبَ جَمِيعًا Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala forgives all sins. إِنَّهُ هُوَ الْغَفُورُ الرَّحِيمُ He is the forgiving. The scholars of tafsir, brothers and sisters, they call this verse, أَرْجَ آيَةٍ فِي الْقُرْآنِ The verse that gives the most hope in the Qur'an. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, brothers and sisters, calls people who associate someone in worship with him. لَقَدْ كَفَرَ الَّذِينَ قَالُوا إِنَّ اللَّهَ هُوَ الْمَسِيحُ بْنُ مَرْيَمْ Indeed they disbelieve those who say that the Messiah, Isa عليه السلام, is the son of Allah. لَقَدْ كَفَرَ الَّذِينَ قَالُوا إِنَّ اللَّهَ ثَالِثُ ثَلَاثَ Those who say that Allah is one of three are disbelievers. And after that, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, أَفَلَا يَتُوبُونَ إِلَى اللَّهِ وَيَسْتَغْفِرُونَ وَاللَّهُ غَفُورُ الرَّحِيمُ Why shouldn't they repent and they turn to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in repentance and ask His forgiveness? Allah is forgiving and merciful. وَالَّذِينَ لَا يَدْعُونَ مَعَ اللَّهِ إِلَهًا آخَرْ وَلَا يَقْتُلُونَ النَّفْسَ الَّتِي حَرَّمَ اللَّهُ إِلَّا بِالْحَقِّ وَلَا يَزْنُونَ وَمَنْ يَفْعَلْ ذَلِكَ يَلْقَ أَثَامَ وَلَا يَزْنُونَ وَمَن يضاعف له العذاب يوم القيامة ويخلد فيه مهانة إلا من تاب وآمن وعمل عملا صالحا. People who associate someone in worship with Allah, people who kill, people who commit adultery, yet Allah سبحانه وتعالى is calling them to repent. Brothers and sisters in Islam, في صحيح البخاري حديث عمر بن الخطاب رضي الله عنه himself عمر and some of the companions were standing with the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam and they saw from a distance a woman carrying her infant, a baby, breastfeeding him, taking care of him. 
And you know when a mother takes care of a little baby, you can sense the love. The Prophet wasallam asked the companions, do you think this woman at any stage can throw her infant into the fire? The companion said, no, O Messenger of Allah. The Prophet wasallam said, لَاللَّهُ أَرْحَمُ بِعَبْدِهِ مِنْ هَذِهِ الْمَرْأَ بِوَلَدِهَا Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is more merciful to his servants than this woman to her baby. Brothers and sisters in Islam, في صحيح مسلم, حديث أبي موسى الأشعري رضي الله عنه إن الله يبسط يده بالنهار ليتوب مسيء الليل Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala extends his hand at night, at, at, during the day for those who send at night to repent. وَيَبْسُطُ يَدَهُ بِاللَّيْلِ لِيَتُوبَ مُسِيءُ النَّهَارِ And he extends his hand at night for those who sin during the day to repent until the sun rises from the west. Brothers and sisters in Islam, Sa'il Bukhari wa Muslim, من حديث أبي هريرة رضي الله عنه, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala descends in a manner that fits him. Don't, don't ask how. ليس كمثله شيء وهو السميع البصير. He descends at the th- last third of the night towards the last third of the night, and he calls upon you. Anyone who wants something from me, I'll give to him. Anyone who asks for forgiveness, I will forgive him. Can you imagine? Every single day, الملك, and he is the king. He does not need us, but yet he descends every night, calling upon us to ask him for forgiveness. في صحيح مسلم, حديث أبي در, رضي الله عنه, يا عبادي كلكم ضال إلا من هديته All of you are misguided except those who, who, whom I guide All of you are subject to sin So ask me to forgive you I will forgive you Brothers and sisters in Islam في سنن الترمذي من حديث أنس بن مالك رضي الله عنه الرسول صلى الله عليه وسلم said If your sins حديث قدسي that Allah سبحانه وتعالى said if your sins reaches the heaven, the sky, can you imagine? Can you imagine? Can you imagine someone who sins the amount of sins that it will reach the sky, the sky that we see? If your sins reach that much, and you ask Allah to forgive you, and you go to Him without committing shirk, Allah Subhanahu wa Taala will forgive these sins for you. لو لو أتيتني بقراب الأرض خطايا If you come to me with sins filling earth You do not associate someone in worship with me I will bring you the equal to it Equal amount of it of forgiveness Allah is not your enemy brothers and sisters in Islam Allah loves you Shaitan is your enemy Allah wants you back Now it's the time What are you waiting for? What are you waiting for? الرسول صلى الله عليه وسلم أن جبريل عليه السلام ميد دعاء against someone who Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala extends his life to observe Ramadan and he comes out of the Ramadan not forgiving في سنن الترمذي من حديث أبي هريرة رضي الله عنه the Prophet صلى الله عليه وسلم said a loser a loser someone whom Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala extends his life to observe the month of fasting and yet, he comes out of the month unforgiven. Brothers and sisters in Islam, now it's the time. Now it's the time. What are you waiting for? This is your last third of the month. Don't be amongst those whom the Prophet wasallam and Jibreel السلام, made dua against. Remember, Rasul wasallam said, and the hadith, في صحيح مسلم من حديث أبي هريرة رضي الله عنه الصلوات الخمس the five daily prayers الجمعة إلى الجمعة and Friday to Friday ورمضان إلى رمضان and from Ramadan to Ramadan مكفرات they expiate the sins إذا اجتنبت الكبائر as long as you stay away from the major sins we must understand this hadith that means there are minor sins and there are major sins. The minor sins will be forgiven through your Salah, through Fridays, through Ramadan. But there are major sins that you must repent of. 
يا أيها الذين آمنوا توبوا إلى الله توبة نصوحا عسى ربكم أن يكفر عنكم سيئاتكم O ye who believe repent turn to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala with a sincere repentance it may that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will expiate your sins brothers and sisters in Islam there are major sins and there are minor sins the minor sins will be expiated but the major sins you must repent of وَتُوبُوا إِلَى اللَّهِ جَمِيعًا أَيُّهَا الْمُؤْمِنُونَ لَعَلَّكُمْ تُفْلِحُونَ O ye who believe, turn in repentance to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, all of you, so that you may be successful. In order for you to come out of the month, inshaAllah, forgiven, you must repent from the major sins. What are the major sins? How do you know the major sins from the minor sins? And how can... You do tawbah from the major sins. A question that we will answer some of it now and maybe the next episode. Remember, the last third of the month is your final chance. You don't want to miss on that one. Brothers and sisters in Islam, Imam Al-Qurtubi, rahimahullah, summed up the concept of a major sin in the Quran. He said, a major sin that any sin that the text indicated that it is a major sin. Like Hadith Abi Bakra, the Hadith in the two Sahih, the Rasul Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, Min Akbar al Kabairi, al Shirku Billah, wa Akuq al Walidain, wa Kaul al Zur. One of the greatest or the major sins is that you associate someone in worship with Allah Subhanahu wa Ta'ala and that you become abusive to the, your parents and that you speak falsehood. Another type of major sin, if Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala promised you hellfire for doing it, إِنَّ الَّذِينَ يَأْكُلُونَ أَمْوَالَ الْيَتَامَ ظُلْمَ إِنَّمَا يَأْكُلُونَ فِي بُطُونِهِمْ نَارَ وَسَيَصْلَوْنَ سَعِيرَ This is a major sin. Those who devour and eat the property of the orphans uh, uh, unjustly, they eat in their bellies fire and they will be dwellers of the hell fire. A major sin is a sin that has a had. Stealing is a major sin because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala promised a had. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala uh, decided a had, a had that uh, you must be punished in this dunya by having your hand cut for it. Adultery, flogged. وَالزَّانِيَةُ وَالزَّانِي فَجْلِلُوا كُلَّ وَاحِدٍ مِنْهُمَا Flogging for the uh, unmarried. Uh, uh, but for the muhsan, there is the stoning. So any sin that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and the Messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam identified a had for it, it is a major sin. Insha'Allah, in the next episode to come, we will shed more light on major sins that you may be engaged in. And in order for you to come out of the month of Ramadan, because I want you to understand this, whoever fasts Ramadan sincerely and seeking the reward will be forgiven. Whoever stands in Taraweeh sincerely and seeking the reward will be forgiven. Whoever observes the night of Al-Qadr sincerely and seeking the reward will be forgiven. Forgiven from the minor sins. The major sins, you must do tawbah. You must know what the major sins are and you must learn how to make tawbah. And this is inshallah your second chance tomorrow. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Each deed of the seed of Adam is for him except for one. Except for one. O Lord of this blessed month, we praise you for Ramadan. Ramadan. Each deed of the seed of Adam is for him except for one. O Lord of this blessed month, we praise you for Ramadan. And for the book you revealed therein to guide us to the light. To the light. By your grace you sent us this Quran each day that we recite. And for the book you revealed therein to guide us to the light.